Picks of the Week. My pick of the week is a website called Earl Uncover, URL Uncover pro.com what it is is a website where you can put in any of those short urls that you see on the internet today and it'll tell you where the site goes and if it can be trusted it's a very interesting website because there's if you use twitter if you use facebook you know there's there's these short urls everywhere but you don't know exactly where they lead until you actually click on it and some of them do offer previews but you have to know the uh, secret combination to enter into the url to do that but you can never remember what they are. So you can just use Earl Uncover, and it'll let you see whatever it is that you're looking for. So once you enter it in, you can actually see a thumbnail of it, and it'll actually use, I think, um, what's it called, um, ABG or something. It'll tell you if it can be trusted on the web, which is really interesting. So you know if it's a good website to go to before you actually click the link. So it's what is very trust useful. level? The, the trust level is gray. Great, I think. I'm not sure of the names because um, I haven't actually looked at all of them. Try try doing it again, and you should see a thumbnail of Gia Q in there, I think. Well, the um, screenshot is something. It's, I don't, it's this. Yeah, it doesn't always work right if, yeah. it's, if it's been through multiple short URLs, which is interesting because you can, you can make a short URL of a short URL of a short URL, and, and you have to go through a few of them in order to get through it. Yeah, it's through uh, McAfee that does the trust thing. Yeah. But it's pretty cool. Um, so if you have like one of those Adify links or a link box thing that you see on there or you just have a URL that you think might be suspicious but you want to see where it goes before you actually click on it, this is a great way to find out where that short URL goes to. Very interesting. It's, and you know, it's unco- where, where this ahead. comes into handy is let's say I'll tweet something every now and then and then I'll get like a bunch of people giving me like most 99% of the time it's spam but I'm so conditioned to seeing it as spam. Like even if let's say Michael... I tweet something, Michael sends me a tweet back, and he has like one of these short URLs. I will yeah. automatically think, oh, he got hacked or something like that, and I won't click on it. So something like that, it's actually really handy. Yeah, and not all of those short URL shortening services have a way to preview them. So this is a great way to do that, to figure out what it is that you're going to. That way you're not fooled into going somewhere that you don't want to go.